starts with the ninth fret on that third string, full tone bend. So next part is the first string seventh fret, the second string seventh fret, and then the staccato note ten, and then bend that tenth fret second string with vibrato if you can. So next part is that. So you've got three notes of seven first. Pull off the 10 to the 7 on the 2nd string and then to the 10th fret 1st string full tone bend. And then you're running down the blue scale missing out the blues note so that's the, um, the F note on the 3rd string. So you should end up with that. Okay so that's easy enough anyway so you've got basically 10, 7, 10, 7, 9, 7, 9, 7, 9, 8, 7, 5, and then finishing on the root note, the B, on that thick string. <clears throat> and then it goes. I like that type of run, and you'll notice that's one that I do quite a lot as well. Um, so we're hammering on 5 to 7, thick string, 5 on the A string, sliding the 7 to the 9 A string, bringing the first finger flat across two strings, obviously not at the same time, because you don't want to ring out, but you're going to sort of slightly arch it across. So you've got back to the 7 on the D string, hammering on to the 9, and then it's the 7 on the G, 9 on the G, and then you bend that one. So, to finish it off. So you start with a bend on the ninth fret and just end with a bend on the ninth fret. Back to me. Ah, at the end. Yeah, we are. We're at the end again. So please do like, share, subscribe, hit the bell button, come and visit me on the social media, comment below with all what you would like to see or what you would like to see. Great use of the English language there, right? I know. Um, and that's about it. The tab is on my website, dansguitar.com. Patreon stuff is all on there as well. And you can just enjoy the lick. Backing track coming up just a second. See you next week. Mm -hmm.